Hey everyone! Welcome back to some more Let's Play Black Mesa. It's been a week or so since I last played the game as a heads up. And if I recall correctly, when we had left off, we were still worming our way across the surface. Avoiding attempts of both the aliens and the military to wipe us out as they proceed to wipe out each other. We're seeing stronger forces arrayed against both sides and meeting some more heavy artillery. At least in terms of the, of the human military here. But we're seeing a greater number of... Power level is 100%. Stronger alien forces as well. With more of what I think are called grunts. The uh, hornet-wielding armored aliens. <laughs> like that one. <laughs> So far, they have not succeeded in... De well, actually, I think we, we might have been killed a few times. But uh, uh, this version of Gordon Freeman in this reality has made it rather far. So, f uh, so far, let's use the word again. Fully armored. We're at full life. We have good amounts of ammo. So let's see what's waiting for us up ahead. I don't think they realize we're here. Kinda cool, but now we have to defeat our the Marines that live. So let's do that. Oh, mental note, they've got the angle they need to hit me with fragments down there. Snarks weren't so effective and snarky the enemy. Yeah, he's still he's still alive down there. Let's get him. Okay, that wasn't so bad in the end. Aviation Operations Hangar 7. Oh, wow! Listen to the aircraft roaring above. You can only imagine what's happening in the air outside of our line of sight. Oh. Uh. Okay. If we don't do this, he'll kill us. Wonder if we could have shot down that alien flyer before we had destroyed these guys. Not that I think it would have mattered in the end. We 
we learned last episode that these are a trap. You should never use the deployed heavy weaponry. Okay, <laughs> take lots of fire. As you try to bring it to bear. I don't trust this. But I don't have a good spot to place this without possibly injuring ourselves. We'll just keep the door shut then. Or, or, or open. Open also works. I think that's where we're going. If I remember the base game, or base game, the game this is based around, then we need a security guard to access this area and get us through that gate. So let's see if we can find one. Okay, we can't lower that. We can't lower that. There's one of those lifters. We should shoot us someplace. Let's see where it takes us. Oh. Ooh. I see snark packs, which means there's probably actual snarks as well. Kidding me. He didn't kill any of them? All it did was all it did was detonate to the snark packs. <laughs> Alright, well, so much for the mental note. Unlike other types of uh Unlike other items that can be placed into your fifth weapon slot snarks are snark packs are affected by other types of items that go into your fifth weapon slot okay i tried to be clever and all i did was just make me lose access to all those wonderful snarks okay no, we're not allowed in there either apparently there's nothing in there that we're interested in though okay let's see Let's pick up this can, put it in the trash can. I feel way too exposed up here. I suspect that we've got some snipers across the way. Okay, maybe that dealt with them. That's not promising. Let's hope there's no other sni active snipers. Woo! 
sorry, but I might, I might need to be over there. Still in there, he's not happy. I think we got both of them. Alright, let's see what we left behind up here, if anything. Okay, nothing. We were just down there. Hopefully there's not a third. I like the addition of the statement as he throws the bomb in here. I remember this from the first game. I don't remember the cursing in this for this part. I like it. It's a nice touch. Oh! And it looks like he himself did not survive the application of his explosive. Tore the door right off of that. I thought for sure the Marines had already destroyed most of those. A dead guy missing his legs. I think there's an, at least one more zombie down there. You can hear it walking around. I saw it briefly. There's at least one over there. No problem. We'll handle him. Saw the blood and thought there was something else still alive down here. Oh, I thought that was a creature. No, it's just a, a gib of some sort. Ah, poor guy hiding out back here. Our level is. 100%. Looks like he has the same supplies that his that one uh, scientist had right before we had gone into the high security explosive storage facility. Oh well, we probably need this, so let's go ahead and I guess place it over here. We should hurry, Tim, just in case this decides to reactivate.
If it's not a red valve, we're not interested in it. Hey! Well, don't that beat all. You're Dr. Freeman, aren't you? Well, the good news is, you just ran into the only guy for about half a mile who has Lambda codes. The bad news is these guys are blocking the freaking goal line. I say we do this nice and quiet. They look distracted enough. If he dies, we can't get we can't make any more progress. Christ. There's no front line with these things. Lock it up. They're giving out no extraction points. Except for five my ass. This whole operation is foobar. Go, go. All right, come on, come along too. Security booth. Down and to the right. Good, good work. That he's oh, got a magnum. A fresh air. Well done. I missed with this my grenade. Break for it. Yeah, come on, let's go. Come on. Yep, I'm with ya. I'm Jesus, with this is not how I thought my day was gonna go. Get your heart pumping. Yeah, yeah, it will. Good work. After you, good sir. <laughs> I tell you what, that could have been a lot worse. Wait, what? Well, at least it happened after we were through the door. Now, for a part I've been waiting for, I remember being so terrified of this in the first game. And I seem to remember it being in this one too. I'm going to be a bit mysterious until we see it together.
looks clear so far. Good job on the music in this area, too. Very good. Because I know it's coming. Facilities here for the wounded, extra ammo and supplies. They stuff a, cho a uh, waypoint here. And looks like they got wiped out. with him, which is good, because he's really annoying. Let's see if we can go ahead and mark another spot. We need to get out of here. They're just bombarding this place now. And that's our exit. Let's see. To get there in the first half-life, we had to destroy that, which would fall across the moat. Let's see if we still do that here. giant enemy there with the flamethrowers. I'm pretty sure it uh, forces its way in here. And everyone...
Not only are we way behind enemy lines, we just missed the last flight out of here. I sure hope you brought some backup point, Dexter, because we're gonna need it. This is as far as I had gotten when I've been playing this game Let's a few get the months hell ago. Out of here. Oh man! Let me get out of your way there. There is a security turret up there, but I'm only going to throw it if things go really south for us. Ow! I think I'm hurt pretty bad. All right, you scout on up ahead. No, no, no. C come with me. Come on. I got your back. Come on. C come. Come this way. We're gonna How's leave. Ammo, Doc? I, it's good. I want to reload because you keep yelling at me otherwise. You stay here. I don't need you running out there. And you. St st Sorry. No. D I w oh my God. This this way. Stay. I'll stay back here. Yeah. Stay here. I'll handle the big boys. This had a new... A new... Type of creep. A new type of creature in it last time. By last time I mean an age ago when I last played the game. Okay, you stand there and look really cool. That's cool with me. There were... I think they're proximity mines of a sort, which we'll see. Power, 70%. You're with this weird uh, alien guck uh, surrounding them. Because they were alien mines of, of a sort. There's one, right there, I think. There's, a, there's another one right there. That one, uh, though this one is broken, the other one is intact. I think. Got a lot yourself, sirs. If I remember correct, that's the way we're supposed to go. So let's go the other way first. And do a little bit more exploring. So this. This is filled with snarks, if I recall correctly. But you can't get through it without getting through that thin membrane that's around it. <laughs> Snarks, though, once exposed to the air and in a aggressive manner, Will self destruct. I much prefer the original snarks to these snarks. Original snarks leapt just because they could and were really difficult to hit and really annoying and did a lot more damage. Uh, well, maybe not a lot more damage, but they did. They were difficult to hit and it was wonderful to throw them against the enemies so they would be leaping all over them, uh, snarking them. 
fun. Oh, hey. Use a rocket getter rocket. Blew that poor thing up with nothing but bits. We've got another snark nest. If this will hit the snarks. <clears throat> you think this is the right way out? Yes. <clears throat> we'll take him with us in a few seconds. Actually, when we go ahead. Okay, maybe they're not coming. Come on, sir. Okay, I'll cover you. Let's go. I. You're gonna die. We all we all are going to die, viewer, eventually. But I'd feel a lot better if I knew he wasn't. I missed. I missed. I feel a lot better if I knew he wasn't going to die right here. Earth to Gordon. Let's cover. These things give me the heebie jeebies. Dead end full of bee shooting monsters? Oh, you're just full of ideas, Doc. <laughs> There's explosives here. Nothing else over there. I remember there being an ah uh, uh, okay, I say an optional way up here to get some supplies. Some more shotgun shells. Let's head on up here. Snarks. We'll grab some snarks. Looks like that was about it. Might take a bit of damage falling from here. Right, is he coming with us? Let's see. He is not. Are you staying? Are you staying here? Don't worry, sir. I'll keep you covered. I like the sound of the battle still raging around outside. You all good, sir? I'm good. How are you holding up? These poor saps didn't make it. I think I'm gonna find another way out that doesn't involve swimming through shit and leeches. But thanks anyway. Hey, sure, man. Good luck to you then. I remember this in the base game. You should have! I, I might have even given it to you. Those will totally leap through this to hit you. And activate them. Take some free grenades. That's all for the lasers, so that was the only gun tied to those ones. 
That was actually kind of funny. I, Once again, guys, I don't take the guards with me because I don't like knowing they're going to die. And I, I generally view them as just going to die. So, that's the first time I've ever heard him, a guard say that in Black Mesa. Of course, the last time I played through this game was quite some time ago. So I think that's the way we're supposed to go. that he said leeches and shit but this is crystal clear water so there's no shit in this and there's no leeches in this version of the game Now, in the base game, there was one of those fish in this. I don't know if it's here in this one. We have enough ammo to deal with it. We didn't kill it, or we'd see it float up to the surface. Oh, that was an optional giant horrific monstrous fish. Okay, we have to go this way. Sorry. Once again, great place to go if you wanted to get me and I didn't have any ammo, but I have ammo, which means it's a bad place for you to be. Oh man! Alright. Gotta fit into the grooves between the teeth of this gear. Let's, let's do it. Alright, not bad. I think we're almost there, everyone. I think we have just one little area left. Many grenades. 
for our machine gun. We need all of them. Or ammo for our crossbow. Is this just giving us full clips? Let's also reload. Seeing... Oh, seeing all this makes me think there's going to be a boss fight here or something. Because that's what Gordon Freeman's going to think. He's going to think this is a boss fight. That's how we get up and out of there. Just in case you wanted five of those grenades, there's two more here, I guess. <laughs> I always expect the explosions to happen after that. All right, well, they're giving us a uh, play of rockets, so we'll start with the rocket launcher. We're not getting back in here, by the way, once we get over this, but let's give this a try. I'm gonna quick save here, just so we don't have to reclick the ammo. And let's do it. There's a tank. Oh god! Uh, the tank immediately shot down my, uh... Tank immediately shot down my rocket and did incredible amounts of damage to me. All right, good. Okay, rockets are a trap. We don't use rockets. They'll just get us killed. Let's go ahead and uh, do something different. Game, screw you for making me miss that shot like that. Screw you. Oh, okay. That's the thing that happens, I guess. Really super close range rocket refused to hit anything. It is going circles. All right, let's do this again. We're killing all of them. We're, we're killing all of them is what we're doing here. That would mean that the first rocket that detonated probably struck uh, one of these guys' bullets as, as they were firing and not the tank that shot it down. I don't think it would give you rockets to do that.
That's all of them. Let's, let's quickly secure the area. It's kind of funny that. <laughs> they just looks like they just had to bounce into things here in this this version of it. This feels like this brings us right back to where we just came from. It does not. This is too suspicious. Oh, no, nothing here. Alright. Before we go downstairs, let's double check the supplies there. We get another... I'm gonna keep calling them MP5 grenades. We got another one of those. Oh, this was a normal tunnel, which is now being consumed by what looks like Zen... Well, we don't know it's Zen, but it is Zen. Zen, uh... Foliage, as it were. Interesting. It's spreading quickly, if this only happened about maybe three days ago max. children will be fine. <clears throat> These aren't as radioactive as the fluid that's outside of the barrels. Leaking, nonetheless. Though, though to be fair, I'm going to just make the assumption that it's, this is because of the battle and this is not because of uh, it's been left like this, as it were. Nice. We'll get back up to a hundred shields too. Our level is one hundred percent. The Corvo Atano in me just wants to crawl along on the vents up here, but I don't see any path we could take that would let us circumvent any potential enemies up ahead. Shouting at someone, which means there's another person there. <sighs> oh, nice hidden energy for the uh, laser cannon, or whatever it's called.
You know, trenches are a great idea. Please don't fall back in here. Is that all of them? Nice. Military. Actually, this can't be military. The, the military didn't have a base here. Black base of research facility, transit maintenance center, cleared of enemies. All right. Nice. Man. In the first game, there was a battle, a little battle that took place here. Then you, that tank wasn't dest as destroyed as it is now, and it, well, not, not that tank partic in particular as either, but uh, a different one in the base game. And you had to use the big cannon to blow up the door, and then the, the machine gun on top to down some enemies that would appear. In this game, I see. Power I see the uh, tank, I saw the gun on top of it, and I just decided that's probably not worth the effort to go and try to get. Then I saw the marines together in a trench, or rather one of the um, depressions that's used to repair vehicles from under them while they're parked, and uh, decided that those three are a perfect opportunity for me to use the grenade to get a triple kill, because my Unveiled Tournament instincts took, took over. So far, clear. These are still active. Oh, that's interesting. We may want one of these. Potentially. Never mind, it's not worth the effort. That's gonna to totally get me killed. Let's not be clever, let's be smart. We did it, everyone. The Lambda... Lambda? The Lambda... <laughs> we did it, although I can't pronounce where we're going, even though it's a really simple five-letter word. Six-letter word. Oh my god! <laughs> Lambda Research... Ramda re- oh, Ramda? Let's- let's just pretend that the past minute never happened, and let's flip the switch. And head on down. Maybe. Oh, power is restored. In the first game, I would always slip under the truck to have a decent cover while still looking at what I was about going to go down into. I don't think we're allowed to do that this time. And we'll stop everyone when we clear the floor below of any potential hostiles.
I remember head crabs and bull squids in this immediate area. actually a little low on shotgun shells. Bull squid apparently didn't like the head crap up there, but couldn't manage to get its spit on it. I don't think there's anything in the crates, but we'll check two of them. Oh, you know, I just remembered how they changed what's coming up here. In Black Mesa. Wow, since I played it several years ago. It's now more of a puzzle in the next room than the battle it had been originally. In the first Half-Life, they announced the presence of those assassins with silence in the area when you opened the door to warn you that something's about to happen as it were and then you would get hit with uh, those powerful uh, pistols that they wield here if i recall correctly it's like a little maze which it was in the first game of sorts but you can run around it and fight like an arena but in this one if you do it properly you'll never take a single hit but we'll make the attempt to do it in the next episode, everyone, because we're going to stop here at the moment. So thank you guys for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Take care, everyone.